And there's sadness tonight at the death of a wild bear that had quite the following on social media. Thousands attract his travels and exploits on Facebook as he roamed the northern suburbs. CBS 2's Tony Aiello has the story. For weeks, he prowled the wooded areas of Westchester County and Connecticut. Bear 211, named for the tags placed on his ears by state environmental officials. His frequent visits to suburban backyards documented on a dedicated Facebook page with almost 5,000 followers. I think the bear was very charismatic. Uh, it was not that afraid of humans. It would be swimming in people's pools, playing on their swing set and things like that. The Easton police chief says the black bear was critically injured Monday when it was struck by a vehicle on Route 136. It had some broken legs and it was uh, barely breathing when my officers got there. The chief says state environmental officials directed that the bear be euthanized. It's many fans sharing sadness on social media. Quote, he gave us short little moments of innocence in our crazy busy lives. And sweet bear 211, in your short time here, you left your paw prints on our hearts. For all the sadness at the fate of Bear 211, some are not surprised. They feared his comfort level around humans would lead to trouble. Bears and other wildlife, a focus at Earth Place Nature Center in Westport. <laughs> Becky Newman is director of nature programs. We are living with nature. We all need to coexist. Newman says that means respecting boundaries by not inviting or encouraging interaction with black bears, which can diminish their natural fear of humans and vehicles. I'm hoping that the takeaway can be that we respect nature and wildlife from a distance and we can coexist with them without trying to make them our pets and our projects. In Easton, Connecticut, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. Oh, well, members of the Facebook page that attract Bear 211 are raising money for a sculpture of him to be placed at a wildlife rehab center. It is a balance, that's for sure. Yeah, from a distance, it is. by the way. Definitely.